Rise and shine people, good morning everyone, welcome back to JTVK Today we will have a full day of plant-based eating and of course a workout because it's been so long since I worked out and I'm going to show you what I eat for the whole day but mainly plant-based and let's have a push workout So stick around, have a look at what I eat and I hope you enjoy the video But before that, let's have some breakfast so this is the staple breakfast that I have every morning. We've got overnight oats. I put oats and almond milk. I'm not sure how much of oats I have here because I made a whole Tupperware for my family and this is what I have left for my family. So if I have fruits, blueberry, strawberry and banana, one full banana and it's gonna be on top of the overnight oats some black seeds to be top on it and some homemade granola from my mom so everything else is gonna be on this plate and, and there you go everything's here i'm just gonna add some black seeds one teaspoon on top of it and then some granola I basically eat this every morning so it's a very simple breakfast and yeah that is for morning yes. three hours later all right for those who are a big fan of char siu we've got tofu and tempeh and this is such a high protein lunch i'm gonna calculate the macros i'm gonna link it somewhere here so you can kind of see that we can also get all the protein intake just from a plant-based diet the way i see it you're actually replacing tofu as char siu and tempeh as chicken breast so if you're a big fan of chicken breast and char siu this is the way to go high protein plant-based meal yeah a few inches later so we're gonna do a push workout today that's gonna involve parallel dips ring push-ups thrust extension anything that doesn't involve me to put my waist on extended position and compressed position because it's kind of still feeling funny yet here so dips 50 reps of dips i'm not sure how many ring push-ups i'm gonna do thrust extension but i want to get 50 reps of dips in one minute rest in between and let's see how it goes I don't think I will do weighted for a moment because I'm just starting it back after one month of up on training it so it's better for me to just stick to body weight body weight is enough as long as you have the tension mind to muscle connection and it is really enough so I'm not doing with that today I'm gonna change up the variation a little bit to so put it like this so it's like a white parallel bar dips it's gonna be fine chest is burning so if you're new to bodyweight training do check out my instagram i'll link it somewhere here and remember one tip of bodyweight training is do it slow because you i mean whoever is watching this video or if you're a beginner intermediate we tend to do body move movements very fast dips push-ups wrap it up wrap it up wrap it up the same, amount, the same amount of reps that you do 10 dips like what I did just now If you do it slow and controlled and focus on your mind to muscle connection It will be very different from you just busting up 10 reps like in 20-30 seconds So take it slow, slow and steady and focus all your attention in the desired muscle groups that you want to work on We're gonna do some Bulgarian 
bring push ups. To finish up, we're gonna do some reverse push ups. I personally feel this push up variation targets the chest a lot more, so we can give it a try. Okay, let's go. That's all for the push workout. Like I've mentioned, bodyweight training is not just about wrapping up reps as fast as possible. It is to take control of your movements and your reps, slow and steady, mind to muscle connection. With that, you realize a big difference compared to when you wrap up reps. So, if you're interested to build muscle and strength with bodyweight training, do let me know in the comments down below or through Instagram and I'll contact you and we will get started. Alright, time for dinner. I'm gonna prepare a high protein dinner. I've got all my plant protein here. I've got tofu, tempeh, lentils and black beans. So everything is gonna to come together and I've got edamame too. You're gonna to boil some edamame for some extra protein. So everything right here is gonna be my dinner. Yes. So of course, I'm gonna fry some tempeh first before I put the oil. I cut and cook my tempeh in cubes because it is much easier to cook and it's also easier to eat. Tofu is done. I'm gonna add the black beans in. Lentils in. I like to also add a little bit of water so it's not too dry. So this is the end product, black beans, lentils, tofu, tempeh, and most importantly, we're gonna add some nutritional yeast to top it up the protein. Yeah. It looks very yellow and very brown, but it's gonna be good. All right, to my workout room, and I actually want to share something with all of you. Take a look at what I have. I this. I was going to drink one of these. So this is actually a liquid meal. It's a complete meal. It's from Focus Foods. You can check them out in Instagram. I'll link it in the video. Look at this. It's actually fast, easy, complete, and it is vegan. So this plant-based. If you look at the ingredients at the back, it has all of these ingredients, natural ingredients, pea protein, oats, and you can read it here. And this is actually a small packet and it is the it is the 80 gram one that says here that has 24 grams of proteins 350 calories it's actually a meal itself it's not just a protein shake oops it's actually a complete meal that's why i say it's complete meal and thanks to focus foods for sending me this i'm gonna finish it of course not not immediately but whenever i'm feeling hungry and I just had my meal or post-workout, pre-workout. I have this and it tastes so, so good. I'm gonna make a review for you right away. I'm gonna take one of these. It's the same thing, but it is in bottle form and they gave me two bottle samples. And they also have these daily greens. What's in there? There's spirulina and there's a lot 
things in there is your greens daily greens mixed with water and you can drink it if you're looking for convenience easy really really easy you just put it in this you just put this in a shaker shake it and you actually have a proper complete meal and for quality protein quality calories quality meal focus food is the way to go check them out on instagram for now i'm just gonna give this a try and here we go so i actually just added water and i just shake it so let's try it's really really good it is chocolate it says here it says here original chocolate there's chocolate mint unflavored and unsweetened this is the original chocolate and i actually quite like it because it's so convenient it's in a bottle you just add water and shake then you have your meal 350 calories and 24 grams of protein and it's so natural it's fast convenient i would really recommend this liquid meal if you're someone who is struggling to meal prep and if you're a person who struggles to make healthy food choices outside or at work you can buy this i'll put a link down below so you know where to find focus food so that brings me to the reason why i'm doing this you might be wondering why am i doing a full whole day plant-based eating first reason is i want to see how a plant-based diet affects my training my recovery my performance in bodyweight training after talking to a few friends they gave me some advice some recommendations Shout out to Kylie and Eliza, my clients. They are part of this journey to help me get into a plant-based diet. Second of all, I am pretty sick of meat, especially. I know I love chicken breast, but over time you eat, the more you eat chicken breast, you'll be thinking whether if you can maintain chicken breast all day long. And of course, there are a lot of meat options, but I just can't see myself eating a big amount of meat every day to hit my protein intake i'm just sick of taking a lot of chicken breast every day don't get me wrong i'm still eating fish but i'm trying to replace most of my protein intake from plants and number three <laughs> it is cheap meal prepping a plant-based meal myself it is so 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 cheap it is cheaper than getting meat and it saves the environment i just want to clarify that i'm not a full vegan i'm just replacing most of my protein intake with plants and it actually felt quite good so yes that is all for the video thank you for watching the video i hope you enjoyed my full day of eating if you enjoy this kind of video leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and let me know if i should do more of this next time and i'll see you guys in the next video